I'm just super excited that they made it through the winter, so uh, a little bit anxious. Whoop, one found me. So, I'm gonna get out of here before they, ah, bugger. Got me. Oh, it got me. Got me right there. So let me show you a trick. While that starts to accumulate, swell, you get that stinging sensation, kind of starts to burn. Um, there's a quick solution to this sting. So what we do is we come down here into the grass and we find what's called plantain. This is broadleaf. There's also narrow leaf plantain. Here's some more plantain here. So what I can do is I can mash this up. Mashing it up, mixing it with saliva, getting the juices of the plantain out. And if you have a band-aid so it doesn't look so gross, this is a lot easier for you. <laughs> but you'll take that poultice Put that right on the sting and just let it sit for a minute and that'll actually neutralize the toxins that pulse the uh the plantain has a neutralizing effect of the toxins from the bee sting and it'll do the same for for uh bee venom spider bites chiggers ticks it kills ticks and chiggers um all kinds of cool benefits from plantain so looks a little gnarly when you're putting all this nasty mashed up stuff you just spit on in your face but it stops the sting inside of like 20 seconds if you get a good glob on there. I didn't really get anything on there, so I'm gonna do it again. But um, we're in this we're in this field, so I got stung over there by the hive trap. We're in this big field here, lots of plantain, right? Nature always has what you need, usually right by your feet. And that's all you're doing. Oh. I'm a model. How's that, how do I look? Is that TV worthy? Am I going to get canceled for spitting on myself? <laughs>